Sweetians, welcome back to Zweetieville. If you're new to my channel, welcome to Zweetieville. I am Sweetie Pie, and today we are back with Let's Discover University, our LP in which we are joining Addison here. And this will be a part two. She should be getting ready to get up. So just let her. Oh, there we go. She is a genius and more focused in mental pursuits, which are required to remain happy. Yeah, she'll get there. It's okay. So she is going to get up and come and up. Oh. They cooked her out of house and home. Yep, they sure did. Oh, so these are what the new robot parts look like. That looks neat. Okay. Because, you know, she did a little upgrading on her little radio here. So let's see. Let's have her have breakfast. Um, make yourself a fruit and yogurt parfait, my dear. And we're probably not going to be here long, so I'm not going to worry about stocking up the fridge. We'll just worry about taking care of ourselves. Then we're going to come use the toilet and take a quick shower. Well, I'll, I'll let you sing in the shower because, you know. Oh, you got the gourmet cooking skill from parfaits. Okay. Whatever. Wow, that's going up quite a bit. And then I'll have you clean that. And then we need to apply for university today and start that trip. Come on. So, let's see here. She, heard you became friends with your dad. Yep, pretty much. So she got the good manner trait, responsible, emotional control with it. So, and her traits are a talented, if you didn't watch the first one, which is a Kawaii Stacy um, um, trait. So it is not a game trait. She is a music lover that she got from her mother and a genius that she got from her father. She doesn't have a job yet because she wants to do this. So we need to start working on that aspiration now. So we're going to let her finish getting around for the morning. Have her enroll, pack her up. What? Mail's been delivered today? Please help me, Bills. Okay, well, go get the mail. It could be a, a uni thing, so you never know. Bills are usually on Monday, not Saturday, so we'll see. Oh, it might be presents. She had her birthday yesterday, so it could be. Oh, you gotta mop that up too. You're making a mess everywhere. You just wore that the other day. Couldn't have picked a different outfit. Whatever. Whatever, girl. She got everything for the mailbox. Okay. Oh. She got a time capsule. Thanks for the gift. We're just going to sell that bad boy for money. I'm not going to sell the parts because I don't know what she'll need for robotics. So we're good there. Alright, so she's good. She's done everything. She's looking good on her stats. Like, it was hard to get her there at first. Woo! So, let's have her come over here. Go to university. She wants to enroll in university now. She had her birthday party. Told her by she was going to Foxbury University. She was not going to Brychester like her parents wanted. She got accepted. She's got all this stuff. She is going to go for her dreams. She hasn't quite decided what that is yet, but she knows it needs to have Foxberry in it because she wants to be a bot savant. Hmm. She's like, hmm, let me think. Uh huh. She's like, haha. Okay. 
So, we are going to go to Foxbury University. The newer of the two universities in Brychester, the Foxbury Institute, was established only a half century ago with the help of a generous land grab endowment. Ooh. Um, but already has established itself as a premier place of higher learning with a striking modern campus, impressive lab and facilities, and litany of alumni, oh yeah, I hacked that word, who have gone on to storied careers of innovation. The Institute sets out to inspire future generations while teaching students to aim high and dream big. It has the Spirit Squad, Brainiacs, and Bot Savants. All right, this is everything she's unlocked. Um, she can do art history. She has a distinguished degree for biology, which will help in the bodybuilder, botanitis, and doctor. Um, let's go back to the arts degree. We'll do art critic, patron of the arts, and trendsetter. Communications, we'll do the careers of charity organizer, journalist, or management and public relations. Computer science gets the new computer engineer degree, which I think is what she's going to go for. It's either that or the teaching. I don't know. Freelance programmer, Oracle, or itch, startup entrepreneur. She got the culinary arts, which is good for being a chef or a food critic. Drama she got, so she, actress, comedian, internet personality. Economics she got for the distinguished degree which could be an administer, an environmental manager, or an investor. I've been thinking of that one for her. I'm not sure. Fine arts will be for a floral designer, freelance artist, freelance fashion photographer, and master of the real musician or a stylist. A history major could be for a judge, an officer, or a politician. Um, language and a literature be for an author, a freelance writer, or a private attorney. Physics can be for a mechanical engineer, that's that new one. Scientist or a space ranger. And psychology is covert operations detective, diamond agent, or villainy, which is boss, interstellar smuggler, or villain. Okay, so what does she want to do? Um, let's see here. We could go for mechanical engineering. That's not her. She could be a judge. That's not her. The administrator career. I think we're going to go with the administrator career. So I really want to see the new teaching career out of all the ones that she got. But, I mean, the new mechanical, mechanical engineering career, too. Oh, okay. We're going to do this. And we are going basic economic theory working on my market moves and modeling currency and then electives she could do yoga painters digging deep arcology holiday singing okay so these are just like skill things so i think we're gonna go all four classes Whew, which adds macroeconomics can she do a full class load well we're gonna try it so we're going to start her with the economics degree, distinguish she's going for administrator, which is the new one, and a full class load. And she is going to live on campus, um, university housing, we can live here, or we can live off campus here. Oh god, that's a lot. Or we can live here. Okay, I'm gonna go here. Sims may choose to live in university housing. This 
places Sims on campus living with other non-playable roommates also attending university. Housing costs may be paid per term as Sims are encouraged to bring everything they may need for university in their personal inventory before moving as they will not be able to alter university housing directly once they are moved in. Student officials will still be available to purchase at the kiosk and at the university campus. All right, we're gonna go there. All right, so each of our classes costs $240. Our housing, and then with all of her scholarships, oh my gosh, and her merit, she pays nothing to go. Oh my goodness, really? Wow, she made it with all of her scholarships. She doesn't have to pay anything. So, I mean, I was going to take out a loan so we could see how that works. Um, but, I mean, Sim will owe cost plus interest, which is $0. So, like, why, go, why do that? We'll just pay $0 with the household funds. So, I mean, that I have never seen. They've always had some sort of stuff left. So, she has made out. All right. So... Uh, oh my gosh, I forgot to put her personal inventory thing in. <sighs> okay, well, we'll just have to rebuy it and I'll give her her money back, I guess. I'll sell all lot furnishings. No, don't do it. We're just going. Oh my gosh. I didn't think that would go immediately. Oh, I didn't grab her chest. Oh my gosh. No computer, no, no. Oh. That is so sad. <laughs> we'll go back and get it. I'll, I'll, I'll go get it. Oh. So, for you guys, if you haven't played yet, make sure you put everything in your chest and you put your chest in your inventory before you do this all right so oh, we are here <laughs> and this is the university so our rooms look like this oh my gosh there is a pink room all to yourself oh <gasps> she wants this room assign this bed to you you know you want that room. There's three people in this room. Two in this one. Two in that one. Okay. Lock door for everyone but Addison now. Okay. All right, so she wants to get started right away on her homework. So, I'm going to have to figure out how to get that back. Buy a B-Box. Yeah, that's not happening. Get a promotion. Girl, you ain't got a job. You ain't got a washing machine. You're not going to do vampire research. You're not going to buy a dryer. You're not going to get a promotion. Can I get something that you can get while you're at uni? Teach responsibility. Okay. Have a water balloon fight. No, thank you. Buy a washing machine. No, thank you. Share ideas. Okay, we can do all that. So she wants to get right down to it and start her homework. But can you come and meet the people that you are going to live with? All right. And I have to answer this phone thing really quick. So I will be right back, guys. One second. All right, y'all. I'm sorry about that. We are back. So, I'm going to have her come and meet. And, I mean, the dorm, as it looks, you know, not bad. I mean, we don't have the open showers. We got 
you know, the shower stalls. I put up the walls here so we can see. So that's a little bit of privacy. We have one sink here, one sink there. We have three of the stalls here and mirrors. So it's not bad. As for an EA build, it doesn't look too horrible. It looks kind of cute. All right. So here's the mailbox and the trash chute. You can apply for scholarships in university. Oh, wow. And then her room here looks like this. She don't have very much, but I mean, she has a dresser. She has a table. She has that. Um, pretty sure I already did that, didn't I? Yeah, okay. She has this dresser. She has a bookcase. So she has all the essentials. Can you come and um, give her an introduction? I kind of Are you coming to uni? I just want to kind of know. I'm going to meet you. I could care less about you. You're not in uni. You're just here because of somebody. I just want to meet the people I live with here. Okay, so she's met everybody so far. Whoa, she got 13000 from the house. So I don't feel bad at all. And I can't go into build mode. So... I don't feel bad at all going in here. So we're going to save and go. And I'm going to get her her couple little things that she had. That's it. And we're in this one. Well, I can't. Okay, sorry, my screen's gonna resize here. I didn't realize it was messed up. So, I have to use the free build mode, I believe, is how. you get into it but i don't remember that cheat give me just a second all right guys i am back so let's go in and let's see if i can enable free build mode right here i still can't build Maybe I have to put testing cheats on and then like the hardest code ever to remember. BB dot enable free build. I can't remember that. Oh my gosh. So it is on. It says I can do this. But I can still only manage, evict, or move out. So, oh well, I'm over it. We'll just buy the kiosk. She has plenty of money below a few, oh well. I wasn't expecting her to get money for that house. I just wanted her to have a little bit of money because that house is for parents. So she's not supposed to have that. So, let's look at her class schedule.
So Foxbury Institute degree program economics GPA. She don't have one yet. She don't have none. There and she is uh not started yet. Her basic economics class isn't until Tuesday, and she'll have to submit a term paper. And then working on my market moves isn't until Monday, and she'll have to take a final exam. Then on Monday, she will have a modeling currency. She has to take an exam. And for macroeconomics, that will be on Tuesday. She has to give a presentation. So she has a lot of work to do. Okay. All right, girl. We got this. So she is enrolled in university. Achieve level three research and a debate skill is the next thing she wants to do. So I'm going to have her... Come and meet this one, and then we're going to share ideas with him. And it's really sad how they don't all look like uni people. Um, give an introduction. So I might off screen edit them because I want them to look all unified. I mean, the way the dorm, I want to play it the way it is. Oh, I will change it in a later date, but the first round of playing them, I want to enjoy it the way The Sims created it and just see how it flows to know a little bit better of what I want to change, how I want to change it, and why I want to change it. Are you here? Cool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so she's just talking, getting to know her peeps. So, so far, she knows four of them. Eliza Michael. Yeah. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven beds in this hall here. Eight if you include us. So we should know seven people. So we're going to head out to see the campus a little bit. Um, so we live here. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a person. Oh, here's one of those thingies I need. All right. Get university info. Let's get info about grades. Um, all right, start coming. Enrollment, organization events, scholarships, and terms. We're just going to find out about all of it. Oh, these waterfalls are like the most gorgeous things ever. Where are you? Get your butt over here. Get university info about class grades, please. Where are you at? Oh, there you are. I found you. All these stairs. Look, it just looks so beautiful. <gasps> oh. Okay. Oh, look, she's taking notes. Says, since 
Grades are university classes are determined by the amount of work done and mastery of the material acquired over the course of the entire term. The university is unable to give students a definite letter grade until term is over. However, students could check in with their professors during office hours in their academic buildings or by emailing them at any time they get a sense of how they are doing. In general, going to class, doing the homework, studying from textbooks, completing it. Any final paper or presentation, attend, presentation, attending office hours, and building the course-related skill all contribute to getting a higher grade. Okay, let's see. Um, enrollment. And then organization events, scholarships, and terms. Teens, oh, teen sims will receive a special info pack when there's from their schools when they can apply to university older sims are welcome to apply anytime via the phone okay so if you're playing your game um, you'll receive a packet if you're a teen um, since I kind of started her off and created a backstory she didn't get that so that's kind of sad after applying sims will soon receive their application results which will inform them which distinguished degrees have accepted them as students having better high school grades or experience and relative skills can be a help in landing a spot in distinguished degree program if prospective students are accepted into these programs however they are always welcome to earn any of the standard degrees students may enroll in their first term at our university via phone computer or email i mean mailbox the enrollment form will have them choose their university degree and housing before whisking them off to start their higher learning adventure okay the organization here is the Foxberry Spirit Squad, which is happening right now. So enjoy a nice Saturday on the quad with the Foxberry Spirit Quad. Hey, that rhymed. Anyway, Spirit School Spirit Day is where students can bop around the soccer ball or just kick back with everyone's mascot, Lobster Larry. And then the Bot Savants is in 21 hours, so they meet every Sunday. Um, is your utility bot the absolute best bot, but nobody knows about you? Enter in the utility bot concept of Foxberry Quad to showcase your contributions. You can get a chance at being named Bot Master until next week, at least. And the Brainiacs are every Monday. Why party when you can study instead? The Brainiacs meet in the library for their study session most days of the week where they can discuss upcoming tests and project ideas. If you really want to get ahead, ride with the Brainiacs. Okay. And then Brychester's here, but we're not going there, so it's okay. Next one, please. If going to university seems like a financial burden, consider applying for scholarships that can help lower the cost dramatically. In her case, absolutely takes everything off. Teen and older sims can apply for large variety scholarships, although each has different eligibility requirements. Universities will automatically provide some money to sims based on how impressive their application is. The more distinguished degrees they're accepted into, the better the scholarship, but sims are also encouraged to apply directly for the need-based scholarships if their total funds are low, skill-based scholarships, if their sim has spent time building skills, career-based scholarships, if they have workplace experience, sports and esports scholarships for sims, wanting to be on the team once they've enrolled, or grants related to where they are living. Every scholarship a sim wins will contribute to help them bring their costs down every term they're in university. As long as there's no gap between terms, taking time off by not re-enrolling after a term and will result in the loss of the scholarships. Okay, so that's good to know info. So you can't take time off or you lose your scholarships. No. Students enroll and register for classes per term at university, which each term lasting a week. Students may choose to take between one or four classes each term. Once a student has passed 12 classes, they will have enough credits to graduate. Term may begin for a sim on any day but the last day of the term will always be on the evening of the fifth weekday. Make sure to turn in any papers and presentations before the end of the term. When a term ends, students are asked if they 
wish to register for the next term. During re-enrollment, students choose the number of classes and where to live for the next term, though they may also change degrees or universities at the expense of some credits they've earned. Okay, so if she chooses to not finish, she can keep going. Polite is right. And then she got a full ride. Having a fully paid tuition takes some weight off of your shoulders. Oh, that is so cute. All right. I didn't realize she had that. University apparel. So she's going to buy the sweatshirt. We're going to buy the hat. And we're going to buy the sweatpants because, you know, why not? And then, oh, we already did that. We're going to buy university items after that. Sorry for all the pick picks, but, you know, you just got to. All right. So, posters, posters, posters. Oh, she's got to have a bike. Um, we're going to Foxbury, so let's get the red bike. Maybe it's like a Foxbury bike. I don't know. Um, does she need a rug? I think she's fine. I don't know if we need the book, so I don't want to get that yet. Oh, look. She needs the chair. Oh, oh the soccer ball. She's got to have a soccer ball. Okay. She don't need any barriers because, you know, this is just her. Um. Oh, yeah, we gotta give her her chest. Um. Doesn't have the chest that she had. She needs some flags for her room. Um. We're gonna get this one and this one. Rugs. Um, she's going to get that one. Oh, the plants. <gasps> that one. Oh, a porta pal. Not right now. Okay. Oh, she needs a mini fridge. She needs the mirror. Oh, she needs those. Okay. Then we'll get the microwave. That is not the computer she had, but that's what we're going to get her. And this is not the chest she had, but it's what she's getting. And man, she has spent a lot of money. Okay. All right, you're you're good. Get out. I'll spend everything. Thanks for purchasing the items can be in your inventory. Okay. I want to do that again. So we can get the go to event with ourself, please. Oh, it's going to take us there. That's pretty cool. I'm so excited. I want to play. Come on, let me play. Let me play. Hurry up. Where's everybody at? So we are here. So we were right down here. Yeah, we were right down here. So supposedly the event is happening here. Yeah, I don't see nobody. Okay. We're... I'm going to bike in here just because I want to see her on her bike. Go. <gasps> it 
it's a red foxberry bike, yes! And she's got a red helmet. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Look at her! Do, do, do. She's like, I'm in the building, I'm biking in. <laughs> oh, so cute, look at her! We gotta put up the walls. Not that. I need that button. Look at that! She's like, Foxberry, here I come. <sighs> that is so cool. <laughs> Spirit day will end in one hour. Well, I'm trying to attend, but I don't know where you all are. Then you got the stalls. Are you guys outside or something? I mean, like, where are you all? I want to go to school spirit day. I don't see nobody. This sucks. Where is everyone? <laughs> I want to go to school spirit day. When they showed it on the thing, they were just like literally out and about on campus oh there they are they whisked us up there and they're over here that is not cool bike here hurry up where are you what do you think you're doing Bike here. Oh. You're ruining my life. Why? By the time you get there, it's going to be over. Addison! And you're not on your bike? You're killing me, Smalls. Oh, maybe because it's all the stairs. Now it's really going to be over. Oh, her helmet changed to green. I don't want that. I like the red one. Okay. Alright. Let's see. Polite introduction. Sonny. Oh, no. oh, this is a play oh, song. <laughs> Alright, play girl. She's yeah, like, hey, uh, what's up, peeps? Oh, they're all leaving. Where's Marcus Flex? Oh. Lilith Pleasant. The Pleasant twins have returned. Oh, look. She's all grown up. She's got one heck of some makeup on her. Spray him with stink spray. Take selfie with him. I gotta see this. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so that was a joke. All right, cool. Oh. Oh. Hey, take a selfie with him. Oh. Hi, Five. 
Uh oh. Esports match takes place every Saturday, 6 p.m. at the Foxbury Arena. Tickets can be purchased at the arena at the start of the match. <gasps> oh no, we gotta go. Where where is the arena? <laughs> what is this? I don't know. It's nothing. Guest lecture. Sit in on tutor. No. No school yet. Parking garage. Oh, cool. This <laughs> is not what I want. Esports. No, that's the commons. Okay. What's that? Guest lecture. No, no schooling yet. Oh, this must be it. Yes! Pinnix Foxbury Institute banners attend esports with. Let's go, guys! Oh, they're shooting off stuff. Let's go. Let's go. 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 Go, Addy. She's like, hey, guys. The sports center is starting. You want to go? Don't high five. Don't chat. I said we're going. Addy, if you do not listen to me, we are going to have a problem. Go. There's a talent showcase. Yeah, did you know there's an esports game on my campus right now? No. I'm going with Larry the Lobster. Hold on, Lobster, I'm coming. I sprayed you with Ting Spray. I need to catch up. <laughs> no! Go! Who are you? Oh, Cassandra Goff. Attend. We lost Larry the Lobster. Bad, bad Addy. Who's that? That's Morgan Freeze. Hi Morgan, checking out the campus, I see, huh? Stop. Fine, just, just go, go by yourself. Oh, now you wanna ride your bike there? Fine. Do you get a different helmet every time? Run each other over. <laughs> that was cool. Now you're in. Oh. Since you're in there. No, you don't need to join the sports team. You, you definitely don't. You're not that. But you don't mind going. Alright. Oh, she needs to know him. He's the guy from the trailer. No, you don't go nowhere. Come back, dude. I'll be out soon. What's this building? University housing. No one is in university housing. Ah, so it's right by where I live. Go home. University Mixer Night. A Mixer Night is starting at the campus commons finish. University isn't all about rivalry. Sometimes enemies can be friends. Stop by for an event of comrades and fraternizations between students of both Foxbury and Ubright. Oh, okay. We'll go to the commons after this. I'll stay busy. <laughs> This poor girl. Whenever it's over, maybe. Oh, look! He's riding a bike, too! The little robot! He's like, there's stairs here. He's like, nope, can't ride my bike there. I go around. Bye-bye. <laughs> they should have, like, little bike, path, bike paths next to it. Since there's so many bikes everywhere. So you don't have to get on and up. So we have to change that in my add bike paths. So you don't have so much routing problems. What's this? Oh, nothing. Okay. Well, he went around that way. There he is. Oh, he disappeared now. Wow. 
Okay. So like Sims 3 vibes where like it's a rabbit hole, you can't go in, you can't see nothing. But I can hear it. And I see the lights flash and stuff. That's so cool. Like, you know, I could like fast forward through this. This is like boring. Alright. Oh look, my little friends came out with her. She's like, all right, thanks guys. Nice to meet you. Bye. Sorry I made you stink. Better luck next time. Addison cheered and brought out all of her school spirit, but the other team still won. Oh, and it's cold. Okay. Commons. Commons was over here, right? Yep. Okay. Who's that? Oh, that's Angel. That's one of our roommate things. We're going to come over here. Go here. Does that mean she's going to bike? Or no? No, don't you leave your bike. Is that his favorite bike? Travel. Oh, so you can click it to travel. Put in inventory. Oh, walk the dog. You you bought that. You can get over here and put that in your inventory, girl. Ah. Oh. And then bike here. Okay. Hey, no. Why is this so glitchy? Get over here. Where where am I? Shift click. You no. Know, you are not leaving this bike. Put it in your inventory. Is it just me? Am I like doing something wrong? Okay, let's see here. Go here. Look, I click go here and she'll do it, but I click bike here and she won't. Oh my gosh. Okay. So you click go here and she'll just go after you set it to her favorite. This is so cute. Look at her go. She's like, hold on. I gotta take it down. Too many stairs. Yep, it definitely need, needs bike paths. No, oh, he's so tired. We'll say hi to him later. <laughs> Who are you? Let's let's get to know you. You're Becca. Okay. Do a keg stand. With him. I want to do a cake stand with the lobster. Come on. Oh, I gotta get a good angle. Oh no. She's gonna do it. Alright. Here we go. 
Let's get to know everybody that's here. That's our roommate. We don't know you. We don't know you. We don't know you. Oh, you're from the trailer. I want to know you. Uh oh. Girl's gotta go use the bathroom. She's hungry. Uh oh. We can't eat no more. Alright, go meet those. He's like, I'm dead, I'm dead. Alright, come on. Okay, go meet the next one. Give apartment key, let's not. Go meet the next one, she got pee. Oh my gosh, she's having so much fun on day one. Alright, now she's gonna go to the bathroom. She needs to go. Come on. You cannot have an accident here. It would be so sad. Go, 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 go. Get in there. Oh, she's using the stalls for the first time. She shut the door on us. We're going to get a stall picture. Oh, she's got a blue and white sink that matches. Oh, that's so cute. Alright, so we are going to go home now. It's 1 o'clock in the morning. She's done an awful lot. Compliment someone. Okay, what are you doing? Wow. Man, these bike issues are really something. Foxbury needs bikes passed. Do 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 run home. All right. She's home. All right. Oh. She don't have anything on Sunday, so we can always do our homework. All right. Ah. 
Huh. We need to go to our room. And we can put up everything in our inventory. So, we have her chest, we have her ball, here's her microwave, her new that, that, let's see, oh, no, we're not going to. Okay, so we can put up this over here, there we go, and we'll put this one here, oh, she has a turn presentation board, oh, that's so cool, okay, we'll put this one Oh, it goes way up there. Is it slow? It's lots of knees. Okay, cool. We're going to put it here. Um, we need... We'll put that here. Put that one here. And that one there. Okay. So her room is done. It's pink and red. All right. So let's have her have a microwave meal. She's going to eat some pizza rolls. And then we're going to go to sleep. Because we have no class on Sunday. So we looked around the campus today. We did good. And we're going to start with the... Uh, knowing everything tomorrow and getting stuff done oh her room looks so adorable just like her there's her little pizza rolls you can go out here to eat them she's like hi guys I'm gonna sit here and eat my oh. pizza rolls and fall asleep. Give it around. Oh, she's a breeze. Oh, she's so cute. She's like, yum, pizza rolls. <laughs> Alright, do you know him yet? Yep. We know Angel. We don't know you yet, do we? No, we're, we're too tired to care. Everybody's still up, oh my gosh. They're like everywhere. Uh, <laughs> Alright. And she's gonna be the messy person in the dorm. <laughs> Oh, he cleaned it up for us. We'll have to get to know him. All right, and off to bed we go. And it's not going to fast forward because we have all these non-playables. Oh, so, so sad. Okay. And you can lock computers now, so you can click here. You can click computer security settings. Lock computer for everyone but Addison. Oh, it's the first day of fall now. 
So we are going to end this episode here. We had our first day. We've enrolled. We're here. And tomorrow we will set up and uh, just do all of our homeworks and get ready. So it's going to be a really, really boring episode, but very needed because she's going to have to sock her down. She has these scholarships and she cannot lose them. So I hope you guys have all enjoyed Addison's little adventure so far. And I hope to see you tomorrow for her next episode. See y'all then. Bye, guys.